Hello, everybody. This right here is System Test 7. And we have a few different alarms per request. So, and I'm joined on with one person today. Uh, the GE freak himself. Um, oh, voice crack. So, let's go ahead and show you the alarms that I have up here. This setup was requested by a fellow user. They will be linked in the description as well as tagged. So, you can check them out at any time. So, yeah, let's go ahead and see what they requested. First, we have a Kitta KNCSMIB. This is a 2012 model. Very, very nice unit. Um, these are well performing. I really like them. So, yeah. Definitely one of Kitta's best combo units. Over here, here we have this piece of trash the Kitta 900 CUARV. Ugh, I don't really like these. 2023 model. Oh, this is a 5th gen from 2012, the IB. This is a piece of shit 1st gen, so... Yeah, 900 CUARV doesn't really do anything good. It's just terrible at everything, so... We have the COBIC 1st gen. It's back up on this board. Or it always has been. Right down here, we have a 1st alert... SMI CO 100 AC. It's back up on this board. The user did request an SC 9120B, but that one died like not too long ago before I filmed this video. Like it died a month ago, so yeah. This is the closest thing I have to it. And then moving over, we have the FireX FADCQ. This one has the blue light with it. I'll go ahead and do a local test. As you can see, the blue light, I'll do another round. Why not? As you can see, the blue light does illuminate, and it's pretty cool. So yeah, this will also interconnect. I just did a local test right now, so yeah. This is a 2004 model, and this is a 2025 model. So this is second gen. This is a first gen. Um, this right here is the first alert SC 7010 BV. This is the fourth gen. It has the new logo that is printed. And it still has all the icons and text. This is a 2020 model. This one um, I got for clearance. It was like in the lows for like clearance for like $49. So I picked it up. These are good units. They have the low frequency sounder as well as the voice. I currently have this set on basement. So you'll be hearing that in a minute. And then right here. Oh boy. This is a 1.5 gen Kitta KNCOSMB. As you can see, it has a Nighthawk logo as well as no hush feature, but it does have a tamper resist right here. This was made 2000 September 4th. So, yeah, this is a 2000 model. So, let's go and give it a test. Here we go. And this thing might malfunction, Sherp, when I'm testing, so please be aware. It just started doing this, like, the day I got it, so, yeah. All right, so, with that being said, what unit should I test first, Sydney? Um, probably my favorite, the FADCQ. All right, let's go ahead and test it, so here we go.
I'll make it do two rounds. No, it doesn't do it. And now let's go. You know what? Let's just get this piece of trash out of the way first. This freaking Seaway R. All right, any unit came to mind? Mm, for testing? Yeah. Uh, what is it, the IB? All right, let's go ahead and do the 2012 KNCSM IB. Three, two, and one. All right, now let's go ahead and do the COBIC next. They're all going to alarm in CO. Here's where things get interesting. All right. Um, now we're down to first alert units. Uh, which one do you choose? Mm. The one with the voice. The SC7010BV? Okay. Here we go. You'll hear this thing announce the location as basement. All right, now the last one to do is the SMI CO 100 AC. So here we go. Okay, so that was Demo Board System Test 7, and yeah. Cindy, what do you think of this setup? It's nice. I'd say it's pretty nice, and oh, the COSMB, the 1.5 gen with the tamper resist, just decided to malfunction chirp, so I'll just reset this. All right.
And of course, we all know Sydney's favorite. It's this FADC cue right here. Um, I don't like the CUAR. These are trash. Um, so, yeah. Anyways, that'll do it for this system test. And I will go ahead and roll the clips of the dying sound. So.